Hello and welcome. My name is Paige and today we are going to be talking about music in the United States. Music is very important in my life and always has been, so I love learning more about music every single day. Did you know that there are many music genres that were started in the United States? The United States has so many different cultures, so because of that, these cultures mix and the music of these cultures also mix. It creates a fusion of music and different genres are created and are influenced by all of these cultures. So today I'm going to talk about five different genres that were started in the United States. Let's see which ones you know. Before I talk about the genres, I want to ask you, what kind of music do you listen to? It's an important question. And as we go through these five genres, I want you to see if you know them and if you listen to any of them. Now, just a disclaimer, there are five genres I am going to talk about, but that's not the only genres that were started or created in the US. There are more, but I think that the five that I will talk about are pretty important ones that you may or may not know. All right, so do you know what kind of music you listen to? Let's get going then. And the first genre I would like to talk about is jazz. Jazz began in southern USA, specifically New Orleans, Louisiana. That red state right there is Louisiana. It's a style of swing, blues, and improvisation. Because it's improvisation, if there are solo artists, a lot of the times they will not have music to read and they will just play music on the spot. They go based off of what the other people in the band are playing. There are some popular artists, including Ella Fitzgerald, Frank Sinatra, and Louis Armstrong. Okay, and the next genre is country. This is a very popular genre nowadays in the US. I personally don't listen to it, but many, many people do. Now, country was started in the southern USA. People don't know exactly where in the south it was created, but its origins are in the southern USA. Now, it's a style of twang, banjo, and guitar. A lot of the times when you hear country music, there's a banjo or a guitar, but the thing that makes it mostly country is the person's voice. The twang is the way that we describe their voices. If you listen to country music, you'll hear that their accent is a little bit different, and that's twang. Some popular artists are Dolly Parton, Johnny Cash, and Blake Shelton. The next genre is my personal favorite, rock and roll. I grew up with this genre, so I used to listen to it all the time when I was younger and still listen to it nowadays. Rock and roll doesn't have any origin in a specific place, but it was started with the youth of America. In order to rebel against their parents, young people created rock and roll because it was a very different kind of music to rebel against their parents. However, rock and roll wasn't really popular and gained popularity in Britain. Before it went to Britain, it was a little bit different, and then it came back and was changed into what we know rock and roll as nowadays. That's why many popular artists of rock and roll come from Britain. It's a style of electric guitar, bass guitar, drums, and there's normally a dance rhythm associated with rock and roll. It's pretty straightforward, and most of the time you see rock bands and they have a similar setup. So for artists, I wanted to include just American artists. Elvis Presley is one popular artist, Guns N' Roses, and Bob Dylan. Our fourth genre is soul. Now soul comes from African American gospel music or church music. It's described as funky, there's normally a lot of claps, there's chorus of voices, and a lot of movement. There's a specific style that's very popular called Motown. 
Some popular artists include James Brown, Aretha Franklin, and the Jackson Five. Now, the Jackson Five includes Michael Jackson, who later became a very, very, very popular pop artist. And our final genre is another very popular genre, hip hop. Hip hop began in New York City. And it's a genre that describes not only music, but other art forms as well. It includes rapping, DJ mixing, beatboxing, and breakdancing, among other things. There are many famous artists of hip hop nowadays, but some include the notorious B.I.G., Tupac, and Snoop Dogg. So, we learned about five different genres created in the United States. Did you know all of them? Which ones didn't you know? I hope you can go and look at all the artists I've talked about. It's really fun for me listening to people like Elvis Presley or Louis Armstrong. They're iconic artists that many people know in the U.S. So I hope you enjoyed this and have a great day. Go listen to some music now.